Well, hello YouTube. Quality knife sharpening, Jacksonville, Florida here. And I just wanted to show you if you were curious. Here is the Lightning Elite. Lightning Elite. And I mean, this thing, you can't beat it for the price. Uh, absolutely no brainer. It, OTF, the snappiest $30, $35 knife you'll ever buy when it comes to budget. Well, they came out with the Lightning Fireball. Here is the Lightning Fireball. It's much smaller than the Lightning Elite. As you can see, there's the there's the handle comparatively. I just took it apart. And let me tell you something. It is identical, just miniaturized. The difference between the Lightning Elite and the Lightning is the Lightning Elite doesn't make a bunch of dang sounds, twangy sounds. And it's only got one spring where the old Lightning has two springs. And the interior is painted. And I believe that even on this Lightning Fireball, the coating paint whatever you want to call it, is a little nicer than your lightnings. So what I actually did is because the blade was so small, and you can see it's got a polished edge. These come, of course, well, I didn't, I didn't realize it until I put it in a wicked edge over here. And you can still see where I got it, 24 degrees. I didn't reprofile this or anything. It seemed to be, from my findings, a 24 degree edge on either side. And believe it or not, this lightning fireball seemed to come a lot sharper than these lightning elites do i don't know why but here it is here's one that's brand new never been sharpened anything and look at that i mean it's there there's no edge on that so you, you got to sharpen them now that's the blade i took it out because the way it was sitting in there i could not get all the way back to the beginning of the edge and this thing is really sharp now. It's still 24 degrees. I just polished and kind of cleaned it up. So I'm going to put this back together and I'll show you. Everything's identical to that except miniaturized. But let me tell you, the size of this, they done hit it out of the park. This little knife is so bad to the bone. I don't know if this is California legal blade. Uh, it might be. I don't care about California. It can sink into the Pacific Ocean as far as I'm concerned. Sorry, Californians. And with all your unbelievable rules and regulations out there by all the libtards. But I'm going to put it back together here, and I'm going to show you against it, these two, just as a comparison. But I took it, I took the blade out just so I could sharpen it easier. And this is going to be, I got two of them. One's like a truck knife, one's like a desk knife. I don't really need to carry these because of the fact that I've got a Guardian Tactical. Uh, GTX 25 so I got these just for fun and let me tell you 
I mean, you just can't go wrong with these lightnings and or, which I believe is 100% better, Lightning Elite. And now they got this Lightning Fireball. And this little thing is just so sweet. So let me put it back together and I'll show you. Alrighty, there we go. Putting them together, taking them apart and putting them together is absolutely a piece of cake. It's not any rocket science whatsoever. The hardest thing for me is actually picking up these tiny little screws. So have if you're going to take it apart, mine, my little tool here is an absolute piece of crap. I want to say, because I can't read it, that it says T5. I don't know. T5? Is it the same as over here? Let's see. Well, it's probably a T6 or something. I don't know. Either way, you got to have an assortment. So there you go. Lightning Elite. Lightning Fireball. There you go. That's that's what they look like. And let me tell you, I mean, this thing is just so sweet. And just as snappy as hell. Lots of good tension, even though that, that spring in there is pretty, pretty small. But boy, what tension the blade has. I'd say it's got more tension than the big boy. So... I got mine at Grindworks, just like everybody else, but I am just shocked at how sweet that little thing is. No, you're not going out and got no damn deer with it. You ain't doing that with any of these. So, yeah, I don't know why anybody has to complain about the steel or anything. It sharpens up, believe me. The problem is you've got to know how to sharpen. And you want to know your angle degree for sure. These always seem to be about 21 and a half. I'm just kind of going off the top of my head here when they come out of the package. And this one here really seemed to be very a solid 24. So they cut, they do what they need to do, and they're only like... 30 35 bucks 25 bucks or something i mean it was just cheap and you can't get anything better for the price so there you go just a little comparison thanks for watching quality knife sharpening